We are deep in the basketball brackets, not for March Madness just yet, but for the CIF postseason tournament. And one San Francisco school has the chance to make history with a roster that could be remembered for generations. They may just be high schoolers, but the Reardon boys basketball team doesn't play like it. It's unexpected for a high school, for a regular high school team. Junior Jossier Rincher is referring to the amount of talent their Crusaders employ something college coaches have clearly noticed. They've always said you're right up there, like, you know, you're at the top, either 1A, 1B, 1C, you know, but yeah, it's pretty, pretty cool to hear. Head coach Joey Curtin says they have seven players who have either committed to D1 programs or have offers. One of them is St. Mary's commit Zion Sinsley, who returned to Reardon from prolific prep for his senior year. I was here my freshman year and it was an amazing experience, you know. Our team, my freshman year, went pretty far. I uh, had a lot of, you know, good talent that year, and I want to come back, you know, to the Reardon family and also just be able to play high school basketball again. Stacked is an understatement for their talent. One star is sophomore Andrew Hillman, who's from Cameroon. My favorite part is maybe the school and in and out maybe, yeah. In and out? In and out, yeah. <laughs> What's your order at in and out uh, Every time, double, double, animal fries and a shake. Hillman is still getting accustomed to America, but he already has seven D1 offers, and he's got his priorities in order. Everybody is saying that winning state, we never, we want to win state, we want to win state, so I want it too for the gold and purple. Reardon hasn't won a state title since 2002. Junior John Tofi Jr. knows a thing or two about that. His dad played for the team. Being another Tofi at Reardon just means a lot, and also putting up another state championship up on the walls just means a lot. Talent and family is a driving factor, but so is the past. Curtin graduated from Reardon in 2001. He lost in a state title game and missed the winning team by a year. It's been a long time coming and I've been coaching here for 17 years. It's a an ex high school experience that you're never gonna forget. There are no prima donnas on this team, despite the college pedigree. They know this opportunity is rare. I'm definitely living in the moment and I'll deal with that stuff over the summer because I got a lot to, got a lot of decisions to make. And uh, yeah, but right now I'm focused on the main, the main goal, which is the state championship, and we're two games away. You know, every kid's kind of dream in high school, you know, to win a state championship, uh, kind of make history. Uh, so, you know, we haven't won it since 2002, so, you know, it'd be a big time win for us and a, you know, a big time uh, moment.